And back here in West Alabama, students from several Tuscaloosa County schools gathering for a new learning experience. Administrators wanted to show them what one of the most popular programs at Tuscaloosa County High School has to offer them. Kelvin Reynolds is live this morning with more on this. Kelvin. Hey, Sheldon. Give them some hands-on experience. Feed them well when it comes to lunch. Get them excited about the program and then recruit them. Not for sports, for welding. That's how the welding instructor at the Career Tech Annex at Tuscaloosa County High School described what he and his team were doing to get kids excited about the Explore and Technology Day there. A school counselor chose students from Eccles, Sipsy Valley, and Northside Middle Schools and then sent them to the Career Tech Annex at County High School to see what's going on with the welding program there. At that point, they're paired up with those high school students in the program who would show them what goes on when it comes to learning how to be a good welder. Now, students can start in that welding program once they start their 10th grade year. We're fortunate uh, to be able to get the best kids that we can get. And, uh, you know, all that comes together, it just it makes a good program. At first, I really thought I couldn't do it. But once I started getting it and learning more things and getting better at it, I really started to like it and now I want to do it professionally once I graduate. Mr. Wright went on to say that some local welding companies that support the program will actually follow the progress of some of those young welders for years before they graduate. Once those students do graduate from the program, if they have a good and high enough skill level, they could earn as much as $20 an hour to start as a welder in the Tuscaloosa area. Kelvin Reynolds, WBRC, Fox 6 News on your side.